Hi, this is Simon from NetClimber, and in this tutorial, I will show you how to crop and resize your photo using a free online application called PicMonkey. So, first thing I want to do is locate an image that you want to resize and crop. And I have a picture here of some water lilies that I'm going to resize and crop. And then go to your favorite web browser and uh, go to the URL www.picmonkey.com. Once you are there, drag and drop your photo to this box called Edit a Photo. And once you have your photo here, uh, first thing I'm going to do is resize the photo. So on the left, I click resize. And right now it's 800 pixels tall by 600 pixels wide. And then you can also use percentages to uh, change the photo size, but I'm just going to stick with the pixels. And let's say I have to make picture uh, for a banner so it has to be wide and uh, short so I'm going to maybe change that to 750 um, pixels uh, wide and um, and for the height I'm going to have to change that to uh, change that using crop okay so I'm satisfied with the width for now and then we're gonna go ahead and change the height so I'm gonna click apply for resize and we're gonna go to height, I mean, sorry, crop. And then get this box here that we can crop with. And uh, I like the full width of 750 pixels wide right now, and I just wanna change the height. So I'm going to change it to, um, let's see, 200 pixels, uh, 200 pixels tall. Or you can just enter the um, uh, numbers here. So maybe if I wanna change it to 250 pixels tall, there you go. I can just kind of move that around as well. And once you're satisfied, click apply. All right, so now that you have a picture that you like, you can save it. And here you have the quality, Mel, E1, and Russell. Uh, it does um, just uh, go with the default uh, E11. And um, for your image type, you can choose JPEG or PNG. Uh, it's not a real big difference, so just choose the one that you like or just go by the default one and then uh, of course you can change the file name so let's say water lilies cropped and resized okay and then save photo and then we're gonna save it to the folder we got the original picture from and it says saved and then if we go back to our file or our folder uh, we can select that picture and there you go we have a resized uh, picture that's 750 pixels wide and 250 pixels high, uh, both resized and cropped. So that's how you use um, this free online application called PicMonkey.com. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and thank you for watching. Bye bye.